Welcome back! Let's- ooh, we got first travel point, nice. Let's, uh, let's check out the town. Yep, that's pretty much what I expected. Embedded. Anyone who fails to cooperate will be arrested and tried as a traitor to the realm. <sighs> Damn it. Some rat must have sold us out again. You there! You want me to haul you up on suspicion of civil disobedience? But, but I didn't! Ah! What? Leave him alone! <sighs> An embedded dares to find the orders of his lordship! Know your place, slave! We can't use the blazing sword this close to the villagers. They could get hurt. But there are too many agents. Zephyr? Law? Is that you? <laughs> What's going on? Aren't we supposed to be fighting them? You're alive. What are you doing here? The realm of Cislodia doesn't tolerate civil dissidents like you. Law. I hereby detain you in the name of his lordship! If law at one point doesn't say, I make the law, then why are we even here? What's the point? Okay, well, I was going to try and do uh, something more powerful, but I did not want to. I keep getting into... Like, my... Oh, right, it won't let me use the bank sword, of course. I was like, why is it not letting me do it? Because it won't let me. Too close to the villages. Yeah, I'm just gonna wipe him out. It's interesting having to fight without the uh, the fire sword after a while because we've been so used to it for a bit. So can we actually fight Law? It doesn't... It, we, we might be able to. I'm going to obviously try after I get rid of the small fry. My guess is no. <laughs> going on, Zephyr? Why won't you fight him? Is that soldier someone you know? Don't hurt him. Huh? What are you... Please. It won't work, you know. You never change, do you? You've always got this damn going look on your face! I got it handled. But he just... He's my son. Oh, so now you remember me. The nerve of you. I'm gonna wipe that damn look off your face once and for all! Enemy reinforcements. Use the sword. I can't. The villagers will get caught in the blast. We need to fall back. Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> Suffer! Go. Leave without me. You can't... I'm not leaving without him. Alfin, there's no time. But what about the resistance? Everyone's counting on you! Forgive me. <laughs> Hmm. 
We've waited all night, but nobody's shown up. No sign of Zephyr or an enemy pursuit. So, what's the plan now? You really need to ask? We go rescue Zephyr. If he's under arrest, they'll have taken him to Cisloden, the capital city. Assuming he's still alive, that is. I can't believe Zephyr never told us he had a son. I wonder if the rest of the Crimson Crows knew about it. And to find him in that village of all places. Some coincidence, huh? Those fireworks you pulled out of your hat back there. They were astral arts, weren't they? Shion, what the hell are you Except doing? Except I've never heard of a Danon who can cast astral arts. Are you a Renan? Like hell I am! No, of course not. Renan's eyes light up when they use astral arts. And when you used an art, your eyes definitely didn't. So I guess that means you can't be a so-called bright eyes after all. Sorry. You're right. Those were astral arts I used. Same as the ones wielded by the Renans. A long time ago, my family, my people, were once known as mages. A Danon mage? Up until now, I'd only ever heard of them in stories and rumors. Though now I've seen one with my own eyes, I suppose I'll have to believe it. We've been in hiding for a long, long time. Even before the Renans first attacked. That's why no one knew about us. Even before the Renans? Yeah. My ancestors were persecuted and targeted for their gifts. But it was by their fellow Danans. They lived hidden away all these centuries, keeping their existence secret even from the Resistance. My mom and dad drilled it into me that I was never, under any circumstances, supposed to let anyone find out about us. If that's the case, then why did you use your powers back there? I don't know. One second I saw Zephyr about to be killed, and the next I was... Danon Astral Arts. If the Renans knew such a threat existed, there'd be hell to pay. Hey! What? You think I'm gonna go to the Lords with this information? I'm a traitor and an outcast at this point. Or did you forget? What amazes me is how anyone could have that kind of power and yet keep it hidden all this time. Didn't you ever want to use it to help your people? Don't talk like you know the first thing about me, Renan! That's enough. Zephyr wouldn't want this. Listen, all I care about is taking out the Lords, okay? Which is no doubt what her people want, too. Using her powers to help do it only makes sense. Makes sense for who? Us? Besides, Zephyr comes first. We can't just abandon him. It's fine. Huh? You're going to save Zephyr, right? If so, you're going to need my powers to do it. I don't want anyone else to die. Are you sure? Then let's get back to the village. We need to find out what happened. What's wrong? Nothing, just... I'm surprised how dark out it is. Why wouldn't it be? It's still night after all. No, that's what's weird. A lot of time's passed since we arrived in Cislodia. You'd figure the sun would have come up by now. Oh, right. It's not like this back in Calaglia, is it? To be honest, I completely forgot. Uh, basically, it's always night in this realm. Huh? 
It's been that way forever. It never gets any brighter outside, even in the morning. So it's always dark all day long? But how? How is that even possible? Did the Renans cause this? Of course they did. It's complicated to explain, though. It'd be easier to just get to Sisloden so you can see what's going on for yourself. I'll take your word for it. But right now, finding Zephyr comes first. Yay, we befriended. Okay, cool. We got a vegetable juice recipe. Number one! Excellent. Rimworld's perk. While casting an art, press and hold the art button to delay activation until you let go. You can also press R1 in this state to save it for later and charge it. Charge art activate after your next attack. Art can be used in combos. If you cast the same art as the one currently charged, you'll combine into a higher tier spell. These can include arts that Rimworld has yet to learn or only trigger with specific combinations. Oh, wow, okay. So, press and hold the art button to delay the activation, and then cast the same one. Okay. Fascinating. Hootal! Hootal will alert you when there is an owl on the- Ah, that makes sense! Okay. The closer you are to one, the more Hootal reacts. Cool. That's good. Okay. So, let's see. Item Scholar, what have you got? How many points- Uh, press R1 to trigger a media counter tag. Okay, cool. Makes sense. Okay, so what can- what have you got? You've got a couple of things. So. Uh, strength of magic charge, increase the amount of damage dealt from charged arts. Source HU when critical hits are dealt. Increase the amount of damage dealt to enemy weak points. That sounds cool. Uh, what have we got here? When sent flying, press R2 to recover. Okay, that makes sense. That actually might be really good to go for. Um, support art for temporary raises one ally's attack. Ooh, handy for sure. Uh, increase the amount of boost gauge added when downing an enemy. The boost attack that matches their trait. Just the amount of casting time needed to cast a charged art. <sighs> That's good. That's really good. I want to go for that first just because I want to know what you've got. Okay, so. I guess I need to go to your list. You don't have any aerials. Okay, so you got. Fire attack, exploding photon bullets, the big air water, after spews water from the other ground. Wind. Okay, so there's also Thunderblade. Uh, I'm gonna put out Thunderblade. Um, and I'm going to. Uh, sure, I'm gonna. I'm gonna just. Uh, uh, I forgot how to edit. There it is. Uh, I'm gonna. Change leader. I'm gonna make her the leader for all of it. Go see what happens. Um, so, I'll give you. Oh, right. I was gonna give uh, him the Alexandrite, but actually, maybe I'll give that to her. Yes, let's give that to her. There we go. That's cool. Um, and then outfits. What? What are your like varieties? I think it's just the pen. Um, okay, coats, you can... Ooh! Glasses do suit you. Glasses really suit you. Ooh, that's nice. Uh, your character. I wanna see how they look. Oh, that's not what I thought it was. <laughs> um... Uh... That is a better pose, though. Um, change colour. Hmm. I'm just gonna go black. Um, but no, I'm, uh, I'm gonna take off the glasses for now, as much as I do actually like them a lot. Uh, how do I choose none? Oh, remove, there we go. Uh, just because I don't know if people want it or not, <laughs> like, so. Um, I'm working out what, what is good and what isn't. How Zephyr's doing? So, I wanna see I if you've done. got shouldn't be rough. a new, like, just thing for uh, for her. She might have a weapon. You sure do. And it is. I can't do any of them. Excellent news. Okay. That's unfortunate, but that's the way it is. Okay, cool. But those two didn't look like they're exactly on good terms. Actually, now I'm curious. Can Danons enlist in the Snake Eyes too? Definitely. They're useful for surveillance here. Doesn't win you many friends on either side, though. 
So why is Zephyr's kid working for the Renans, then? All of creation across the heavens stems from the six essences. We lack only darkness while they are without light. Thus, to achieve perfection... What are you muttering over there? I was practicing a magic incantation. An incantation? Is it anything like the spells that people use today? Not quite. It takes time for me to finish my chants, so I'm practicing saying them quickly and accurately. You know, just in case. I've... always tried my best never to use magic if I can avoid it up until now. You said you and your family used to live in hiding, right? Because you were a mage. Where did all the other mages go? <sighs> Sorry, I didn't realize it was such a sensitive topic. It's okay. Hey, so, uh, about my magic. You want to keep it a secret, right? Yeah, sorry. A little late for that after what happened in the village, don't you think? Uh. Easy, Shion. It's just... Hmm? I didn't want Zephyr to die. That's why I used it. I know. And we might have lost him without your help. So thank you, Rinwell. Sure. <laughs> Is that owl okay? It's been stiff as a board for a while now. You're right. I wonder what's up with it. Come here. It's okay. I won't hurt you. <laughs> Crap! Huh? What happened? I hate to say this, Renwell, but I lost Hoodle. I didn't mean to scare him, but he took off. Hoodle? He's right next to you. He is. All I see is snow. Dan and owls conceal themselves when they feel threatened. I guess he's still not quite used to being around other people yet. That would explain it. I should have been more careful with him. Sorry. It's fine. I'm the only human he's comfortable with. Come here, Hoodle. Huh. Damn, he was that close? He's just a little wary of you. I think he gets that you're going to be with us for a while, though. Step in the right direction. If you call his name, he might eventually respond, at least. Got it. Thanks. At least he's not sick or something. Indeed. That's quite a relief. Hmm... Hootle is precious. Right, let's see what Rinwell can do in terms of combat. I'm intrigued. No choice. So, this is your magic. Okay, so, Thunderblade. Whoa, okay. So if I do that, delay it, and then do it again. Okay, we're, I didn't get to try it. Um, yeah, I don't know specifically how this works yet. I'm still working it out, but I, I like it. I'm intrigued. So if I hold it, delay it, and then and then go. No, that didn't quite work hard for. Ooh. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty powerful. So if I air fast. Oh my God, no! She's super powerful. Look. <laughs> I love what she's able to do. Yeah, I probably shouldn't be like fighting all the enemies in the world, but. Okay, so was that a more powerful version? Uh, no, didn't seem to be. Let me try. So th this is a delay, and then if I do it again. It, no, I don't understand. <laughs> I wish I understood. I don't. Not yet. I don't understand how to make her do more powerful double attacks. Keep our eyes on the prize. I'll I'll look into that. I think off camera because um, I think that obviously could be super powerful, and I'll definitely want to understand how it works. But I I like playing as her. She's very powerful. 
Enemies who can cast astral arts can be pretty difficult. Not only are they powerful, but their range lets them strike us before we even get close. Actually, I can just disrupt astral arts. What do you mean? When someone is casting an art, their focus has to be entirely on the incantation. So right when they're completing the casting, I just kind of steal it from them. Really? Then what do you do with the energy you've stolen? I hold on to it and use it whenever I want, like I can with my own magic. The thing is, I can only unleash that art once. After I use it, it's gone. Oh, also, when I steal astral energy, the enemy will lose focus, which means they can't cast anything else for a while. So not only can you steal their energy, but doing so incapacitates them too? That's amazing, Rinwell. I didn't realize your magic could do so much. It's actually something of a secret technique within my clan, so I kind of had to learn it. Well, if we come across any tough enemies that use incantations, I'm sure that power of yours will come in real handy. Yeah, it's tricky to pull off, but you can count on me. That is cool. <laughs> okay. No, seriously, she is super... Oh. Oh, that explains it. I was going to say, I didn't see an owl in this area, but that makes sense for it to be around here. Left eye patch. Excellent. <laughs> oh yeah, you can see it's got... Have they all been wearing them this whole time and I haven't noticed? Oh my god, if that's the case, that's atrocious, but I've not noticed this whole time. That's only, what, like the ninth one? God damn. <laughs> It's eerily quiet. No sign of Zephyr. You think they took him away already? What say we quit hiding and go ask some villagers? Someone's bound to report us no matter what we do. So we might as well. Hey, Shion! What? You heard her. She's got a point. Our cover was blown last night. Where's the sense in sneaking around? And what if there are soldiers lurking about? They would have followed us to the cabin already. Relax, the coast is clear. Let's hurry and speak to the villagers. Is she always like that? I don't know how you managed to put up with her. What makes you think I'm managing? <laughs> Let's try talking to the villagers. Side quests! How many side quests are there? Three. Okay. There's a lot going on here. Hey. You look real nervous, kid. What's the matter? Hmm. Hey. You're not thinking of turning someone in, are you? Or are you worried you're going to be reported? Uh. No, that's not it. Then what's wrong? Hmm. The Zoogles, they're... Mm -hmm. They're what? In the way, and... Hmm. <sighs> He's gone quiet again. They're in the way, and... You're trying to go somewhere outside the village? Yeah. The people here aren't free to move around as they please. I'm not sure he's trying to do anything so dangerous. Unless you had a real good reason for it, that is. <sighs> he probably doesn't want to talk to us since we're complete strangers. I don't think he's a bad kid, though. I guess. In that case... Great! Alright, we'll take care of your Zoogle problem. Huh? Huh? We are? Sure we are. We're going to clear up the Zoogles surrounding this village. Whatever he's struggling to do, it can't exactly hurt to get rid of them for him, right? <sighs> I guess. Oh. It's okay. This is something we want to do. You don't have to tell us anything you don't want. Fire beneath the ice. Alright, that's good to know. Cool. Messier Defeat seven two, ice wolf. Two, four. Oh, that seems easy. Now that's a weird name. Messier is basically a code. Oh, it's super cute! It indicates cute. it's a small village. So it's not its What's actual that? name? Then does that mean that 224 is... Yeah. It's merely a serial number assigned to it for administrative purposes. So the Renans even get to decide what places are called out in this realm. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Cute. Cute Ooh. things. Okay, well there's an owl around here. Yeah, having you around is super helpful. <laughs> I think there's someone in trouble here. Woohoo! Well, let's Where see what they, they have to say. Where's the owl? Oh, you're in the basket, Ooh. huh? Wolf ears. Alright, nice. 
Toodles. Looks like we've spotted one of Hoodle's friends. All right, what do we got? Yeah. Hey, buddy. Uh, if it's not too much to ask, you think you can spare some Gilligan? Hmm? Gilligan? Uh, Rinwell, do you know what this guy's talking yeah. about? I think he's talking about alcohol. <sighs> of course, alcohol. What else did you think I meant? Hold on. You folks aren't from around here, are you? <laughs> if I were you, I'd get the hell out of here before someone reports you. Mm -hmm. This guy sure changed change his tune fast. I can't really blame him. People they grow up doubting even their own neighbors, much less strangers like us. Hey. Let me ask you something. Why do you need this Killigan stuff so much? Uh, anyway. What? Whether the bright eyes running the show or not, I still gotta put food on the table somehow. Uh. And without some Killigan, I'll freeze to death working out here in this cold. Yes. So it's not just the buzz you're after. You wanted to starve off the cold. Unfortunately, we don't have any Killigan on us. Uh, is there anything else we can maybe do to help? Yeah. Yeah, we won't ask for anything in return. We just want to help. Yeah. Uh, you mean that? Uh, in that case, could you grab me the ingredients to brew it? You can find whatever I need from the Zoogles. Interesting. I didn't even realize you could use Zoogle past the McBooze. People sure are creative. Oh, I have them. Sweet, oh? here you go. Is this what you're looking for? Okay. Yeah, it sure is. You really don't mind if I have these? Good. They're yours. We didn't really have an urgent use for them right now, anyway. Although, I've got to ask, how, how do you brew alcohol with this stuff? Okay. Technically, you could just bite into it as is, but no one's stupid enough to waste a bunch of good ingredients doing that. What you gotta do is pack it in snow and let it sit by a fireplace for a week. Then, once you distilled the melted snow, POW! Gilligan! But you gotta be careful. Gilligan's so strong, it'll start a fire in you if you don't know how to handle it with care. Oh. Well, that makes me want to try a little... Until you're the right age, Rimwell. I know, you don't have to remind me. Like I said, though, there's no way I can work outdoors with this without this stuff. <laughs> so, uh, thanks! It's nice to see that there's still some good folks in this world. Sweet. And I got a, a recipe for liquor. Cool. I mean, I'll take it, that's pretty cool. Using Zoogles to make drinks. That takes guts. No one would have come up with it before the occupation. That's for sure. You don't think the snake eyes will hold it against them, do you? If anything, the warmth might help loosen them up. <laughs> You're the friends of that man the Bureau agents took away. Please, leave us alone. We don't want any trouble. <gasps> Answer our questions and we'll leave you in peace. Where did the agents take our friend? Sisloden. The capital. That's what they said. I knew it. What did we ever do to deserve this? We haven't even crossed the street without looking first. Why are they after Shh. us? Come on, we're wasting time. You'll need to hurry if you want to get your friend back. Not a single person who's been taken to Sisladin has ever returned. Hey, keep quiet. You're trying to get us all killed. Out of hell with that. Go on, report me. See if I care. I thought this Sisladin was a city. Is it a prison camp? It's the realm's capital. Though when you're forbidden to move freely like we are, there isn't much difference. My parents and siblings were taken by the Snake Eyes. I haven't heard from any of them since. For all I know, they're long dead by now. Anyway, go! And kill as many snake eyes as you can for me while you're there! All right. To Sisloden it is. Yeah, it wasn't that much to find out, as it turns out. We kind of figured it was going to be as straightforward as it's where we sort of knew about, but... Hey-ho. Examine. Milk! Milk taken from a cow. It can be drank straight or turned into other food through processes such as fermentation and separation. I think I'll try to make that new recipe with Sweet. this. Sweet. Oh. All right, but I'll decide how I think I've is. been playing for a while. <laughs> uh. Could you tell? It's, uh, the game is like, mm, yes, charge the controller now. Yeah, I've, uh, I love this game. I love it so much. It's so fun. It's so good. I love every character. I love the story. I just, I just love it. This game's you see anybody got that masterpiece. Can help? We can't chase after every little thing. Yes, we can. Huh? 
You folks look mighty suspect to me. I can tell just by looking at you that you're not from around here. Normally I'd report you to the Bureau and that'd be that. Hmm, what to do? Hey. Look, we don't want to cause any trouble. Is there any way we can convince you to keep quiet about this? Well, the Bureau likes to reward people who report folks. What are you willing to offer me? Uh. Excuse me? Sure. We don't have anything to, gi to give you. We, so we, we don't have to give you anything, but there are plenty of other ways to keep you quiet. Easy, Sean. <sighs> easy? You're the one who's easy. Alright, All right, what do you want? Yeah! Well now, let me see. I know I could use some food. How about you bring me some fruits and vegetables? <laughs> and I don't mean the wilted stuff that grows here. I'm talking about the fresh, wild stuff that grows outside. Sure, you go. This? Is this enough for you? Yeah! Ooh, you got food for me, huh? Well, come on, hurry up and hand it over! Will you promise to keep quiet about us now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I won't tell anyone, I swear. You can uh, count on me. Hmm. Something smells fishy about all this. Why were you so insistent on these things coming from outside the village if you can grow them here? What? I told you, the wild stuff's a lot fresher. The soil here is practically worthless. The problem is we're forbidden from just leaving the village whenever we like. Even worse, there are all those zoogles crawling around outside. <sighs> so you made us stick our necks out for you instead. Gee, aren't you such a swell guy. Enjoy all your food, I guess. Huh? What? Who said anything about eating the stuff? Don't be stupid, that's not what I'm gonna do with all this. Mm -hmm. Well, if you're not going to eat it, what do you need it for? <laughs> I plan on selling it all, obviously. Do you know how much demand there is for fresh food like this around here? That's great. Great. Now I feel really dirty for helping this guy. <sighs> this realm's definitely got a lot of problems to work through still. But I got two life bottles, a lot of gold, and some SP, so I'm happy with it. And no regrets. All they joy. Reacted just like we expected. Yeah. Do you think we... Oh. People are really terrified of the snake eyes. They've got them jumping at their own shadows. They may be Lord Ganabelt's lackeys, but for all intents and purposes, it's the snake eyes who control the realm. One wrong look, and your history. So Zephyr's being moved to Sisladin. Let's cross our fingers we catch up with them on the way. I mean, the plan was always for me to take you guys to Sisladin anyway. But a word of advice. Oh? There's a forest we have to pass through on our way there. I won't lie to you. It'll be dangerous. More Zoogles? Wild ones at that. They hunt in packs led by the biggest, meanest one. My friends and I got cornered by one on our way to Calaglia. That's how we got split up. We'll just have to keep our wits about us then. All right. Cool. Will do. Just through these woods up ahead, you'll find Sisladin, the capital. The only question is whether you wind up arrested or Zoogle food. Thanks. Great that you uh, have true faith in us. The forest we're about to fine. walk through is pretty dangerous. Let's make sure we're prepared before we go further. Yeah, we got a fast travel point. That's good. Rinwell, if you get injured, just let Shion know, okay? <sighs> I only have one pair of hands, you know. <sighs> Spending time with party members. Spend time with party members to deepen your bonds while resting at camp. You never know. Something nice might happen if you do. Oh. Okay. Shion, could we talk a moment? And here I was, thinking I could get some rest. Is something the matter? The matter? No, no, nothing like that. Then if it's all the same to you, I'll be going to sleep, thanks. Is chatting with me really that much of a drag? I just don't get the point, that's all. Is there some pressing reason why we have to talk right now? I don't know, I just... I think we should all make an effort to get to know one another. What if there's an emergency? An emergency? What if one of us suddenly got sick? Then I'd cure them with my healing arts and we'd move on. That's easy for you to say. But for the person doing the asking, it may not be so easy to approach you. If they can't work up the courage to approach me, that's their problem. Unless you're suggesting I refuse to heal someone for the fun of it. I didn't say that. So what then? Quit beating around the bush and just tell me. Look, what I'm trying to say is... If we're going to be traveling together, it makes more sense to do it as companions, rather than 
being at each other's throats the whole time. I still don't get it. <sighs> but I do understand that whatever it is, it obviously must mean a lot to you. I'm not trying to make things more difficult for you just for the sake of it. So, I'll make more of an effort to talk every now and then, even when we don't have to. Happy? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I am. Then if you don't mind, I'm going to get some sleep. Have a good night. Hmm. <laughs> Didn't get it, huh? I think it's time we go to sleep. I do vaguely remember this from the demo. Like, being able to talk to people, but it's... I totally forgot, and How it's absolutely worth it. just sitting around doing nothing, Alfin? Because it looks to me like you're taking your sweet time getting ready. I'm not procrastinating, if that's what you're implying. Oh? Sure looks like it to me. You had me worried you'd forgotten our mission. Again. I know, I know. You don't need to keep reminding me. Hey, Alfin. I'm already over here. R right. Thanks for letting me know. I saw you talking with that Bright Eyes before Lights Out last night. Mind telling me what you two discussed? Nothing in particular. <sighs> I just figured that maybe she would open up a little if I tried talking to her. What? Her? She's a Renin. I know we're working with her, but that doesn't mean we have to play nice with her. Look, we're all going to be traveling together for a while. It's only going to make things harder if we're at each other's throats. If all we do is bark orders at each other instead of working together, that's not much different than how it is for the rest of us. I think it's important that we all understand each other and work together as equals, if it's at all possible. Do we, though? <sighs> because I sure don't get the feeling she means to do the same. <sighs> as soon as Zephyr disappears, all hell breaks loose. We can't get anything done if things stay tense like this. But what the hell am I supposed to do? Well, I guess I'll just have to keep hammering away at them and see how it goes. Oh. Interesting. So. Trigger counter edge by pressing on one defeating an enemy. Okay. Interesting. Um, I've got a lot of SP. Um, increase the amount of damage dealt to enemies get hit by a boost strike. That's good. Increase the damage dealt to attacking enemies. Um, that is also good. Restores AG upon executing a perfect evade. Delivers a swift hard kick while rapidly descending from the air. Right, that is an aerial move, but I'm sorry, I need to get this. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. I'll go for that next time, though. That seems pretty good. Um, uh, I'll look at this later. Like, it's it's been a long video. <laughs> like, Come on, guys. We've got lots to do. It's been a long video. He says, as he goes back to rest, because there's another conversation that can be done and must be done. I must have all the conversations. I get benefits. It feels great. I love this game. I believe I'm camping with a Renin of all people. Shion saved my hide before. You can trust her. But you know how much the Renans have hurt us? Yeah, but Shion's always done right by us, hasn't she? Hmm, I guess. So, no cooking, and... Oh, so you can... Oh, so talking, depending on who you talk to, you get more... You get different benefits. Oh, uh, mind if we chat a little? Interesting. Maybe. I don't know. So my guess is that this one isn't going to give us anything. Hoodle, let me know if you sense anything. Yeah, so that one didn't give us anything. Right, okay. Fascinating. Another day, another goal. I like it, but I yeah, that's going to oh, it's going to be tough choosing who I speak to because like obviously different one, different people give you different benefits. Okay. Yeah, oh god, I love this game. I've recorded for another two and a half hours and oh, it's so good. This game's so good. I think in the span of 2 days, I've got 11 videos. Like and that's like 7 hours of recording or so. That that's not bad. That's that's pretty good. <laughs> can you tell I like the game? 
I mean, it, it's it's hard to tell. It's subtle, but uh, ah, oh, it's so fun, so good.